welcome back again to my channel how you doing I am okay not really hundred um, percent if you must have noticed as a subscriber um, I've, I skipped some of my vlogs you know the past two weeks not uploading actually and yes I have not been hundred percent okay but yeah I'm getting there please bother me for that and yes I'm back I hope <laughs> okay today I really want to share with you a very inspiring story but I want to I will bring it to light with my own aspect of it what I really think and all of that I think this story is really touching is really amazing is inspiring and if we can um, talk about it is um, a story of a Nigerian girl she's called Ola Jumoke and um, yeah, she was discovered. She was a bread seller and discovered by T.Y. Bello. And now she is a model. And absolutely amazing story because the story she was just discovered on the street. You know, it was amazing how it happened. Please read it up if you really want to know more about this. It's, her name is Ola Jumoke. I will write it down so that you see. Amazing story. But now what they actually, I a cousin of mine wrote the quote of the day. Every girl wants to be... Or large okay, but nobody wants to hop bread. And actually, yeah, it's true. Absolutely, it's very true. Everybody wants, you know, this inspiring story. You just think like, oh my God, it's, um, this girl was discovered on the street. She's selling, she was selling bread and was discovered, and now she's a big model. She, a lot of things happening around her. Stories, be, you know, all the television is all over on her and all of that, and ab absolutely amazing. But then you, uh, most of the girls, they want this, you know, thing to happen to them. They want to be discovered you as a woman you still want you know you you want something really amazing to happen to you but you don't get yourself out there for that to meet you yes and they, this brings me down to a story that my mom used to tell us when I was growing up it's absolutely have been an, a guideline for me as well I remember it all the time she she used to tell us this story she made it up I think <laughs> she made it up it's like she said that God want a woman you know she always go to church she kneels down every time in the church she prays and prays God bless me God bless me God bless me and you know yes this thing kept going on and God looked down and said ah, this woman has really been praying for a long time he now sent one of his angels and said take all the wealth in this world take favors uncountable favors and send, go and meet this woman where she is doing something where she is working where she is doing her business and deliver this gift to her you know let her favor meet her there so the angel traveled all the way from heaven and came down and this was looking for this woman everywhere they're making every kind of thing all the people selling things in the market she looked for her at the offices nowhere she could be found angel went back to her god and said i can't master god i can't find this woman i can't find her and then say go again and look the angel went back and looked and did not still did not find her the angel went back to to god and then say i still cannot find her you know and then the god, god said okay we have already brought out this favor to meet someone so this favor go out carry all this wealth all the good things of life and go and meet someone out there who has been sweating all day finding a way to eat food for the day Go and deliver this blessing to that person. So angel, <laughs> the angel now now took all those blessings and everything and now delivered it to somebody who is somewhere sweating a barrel pusher. It can also be Ola Jumoke, you know, that was a bread hawker, you know, that ended up becoming a big model. So this this gift was delivered to someone and the person became, you know, the person became rich. So NJ went back and God said, we actually need to find out where this woman is. And then they looked and the woman is still in the church praying, God bless me, God bless me, God bless me, without doing something. So the whole story brings that, this was my mother's story, the whole thing, she's trying to make us like, you have to work hard for what you want, that your blessings will meet you at a point, you know, where you are working for it, at that your working place is where you will reap. That is where your favors will, will come to you. So, and that brings me back to Ola Jumoke's story, this beautiful Nigerian girl that is a big model now, she 
her favors met her where she was hawking her bread, where she was selling the bread on the street, on her head. Another thing is that you might have your certificate and then you have finished, you even went through, you suffered to go through university. I know how it is. You, you struggled so hard to go through university and at the end of the day, there is no job yet. And you've worked for 10 years, 15 years, getting a pain, getting a peanut change that only pays for your transport. I absolutely know how it feels, but really don't give up. I will also use my YouTube channel as an example. I upload videos and I get 12 views and all of that. No likes, sometimes no comments. <laughs> Thing. But honestly, if I count, if I look through all my videos, I think I have um, um 200 and something, the maximum views I have. And, you know, it, it takes you effort, it takes you, it takes you time to do all these vlogs. But, you know, the whole point is that you are making an effort, you want to do something. But my own initiative of starting a YouTube channel is to inspire someone out there. It doesn't really matter to me if my views are 1 million and no one got inspired by it. I really want, even if it's only one person that views my video but ends up touching life. Maybe I don't know about it, but somehow in my heart, let me just feel like, okay, maybe someone out there have felt good about it. Anyways, <laughs> the whole point is that just keep doing it. If you love what you're doing, if you if you really are passionate about it, one day, one day it will meet you there. Maybe it's not something that pays your bills. Maybe it's not something that, you know, that buys you expensive things or all of that. But at some point, one day, that will be where your breakthrough will be. There will be where, you know, there will be where you, all, your, all the favors will work through. For you you have to make effort every day if this doesn't work try another one if this doesn't work try another one until you get to that one that really works that's the way it is the lesson of the day is if you want to be olajumoke if you want to be discovered <laughs> get going get doing something you might want to be a model you might not be walking around the industry where the models are but get yourself out there and be as open-minded as possible it would definitely work to you. You'll be discovered at the very, you know, least place you ever expect. So you, you just have to definitely put your, all your energy in what you do and keep doing it. If you look at all the people that have made it so far, they tell you the stories, the slides and all the slimy ways they have to walk through before they cut to where they are. Oh, you know, talk about talk show hosts, talk about billionaires, talk about Talk about a lot of celebrities, actors, actresses. Some people even were neglected. Some people were not even recognized for what they're doing. But what? Just one blessed day like this, it will just click. It will just click, and you will be there. And so shall it be for you. So that is it for today, guys. And yes, for my YouTube channel, I have only about few likes and views, but what the heck i love you guys thank you so much for always stopping by i hope this vlog inspires you to keep being you and keep being strong and never to give up so as to get discovered it might not be being a model it might be you succeeding in what you're doing so thank you so much i appreciate you guys thank you and remember to subscribe see you next week soon again <laughs>